Welcome to Japan, a land of ancient traditions and modern marvels. Before you embark on your journey to this fascinating country, there are a few unspoken rules that you should know about. First off, cash is still king here. Many places, especially outside the big cities, only accept cash. When paying, don't hand your money directly to the cashier. Instead, place it on the tray provided. Remember, when in Rome, do as the Romans do, or in this case, when in Japan, do as the Japanese do. Speaking of taxis, don't try to open or close the door yourself. In Japan, taxi doors are typically automated, so wait for the driver to operate them. It's just one of those charming quirks that make this country so unique. Now let's talk about timing. Japan is a beautiful country all year round, but there are a few times you might want to avoid. One such instance is Golden Week. This period, usually falling in late April to early May, sees Japan at its busiest. Hotels are packed, prices skyrocket, and popular attractions are swarmed with locals and tourists alike. Another time to think twice about is summer. While the festivals are a sight to behold, the heat and humidity can be quite intense. So when should you visit? Spring and autumn are generally considered the best times with comfortable temperatures and stunning natural beauty. Timing is everything, so plan your visit wisely to avoid the crowd and the heat. Japan is known for its tranquil atmosphere. People tend to keep their voices down and avoid confrontation. This isn't just a social nicety, it's a way of life. Imagine you're in a library, but this library is an entire country. It's like a nationwide shush fest. So when you're out and about, consider your outdoor voice as your indoor one and your indoor voice as, well, a whisper. Now let's talk trash, or rather the lack of it. It's not that they don't produce waste, it's just that public trash cans are as elusive as a ninja in the night, so if you're munching on the go, be prepared to pocket your trash. And while we're on the subject of privacy, let's talk geishas. They're not just cultural icons, they're also private citizens. So if you're lucky enough to spot one, admire from a distance. No paparazzi antics, please. Respect is a two-way street. By respecting their customs and privacy, you'll earn their respect in return. When dining out, be aware that many restaurants may not accommodate special dietary preferences such as allergies or veganism. It's a nation of food lovers after all, where every morsel is a celebration of taste and tradition. Now on to medication. Japan has strict regulations, especially with over-the-counter painkillers and recreational drugs. So, if you're someone who needs their daily dose of vitamins or medication, ensure it's Japan approved. Good communication and planning can save you from many a pickle, so plan your meals and medication accordingly. When out and about in Japan, always carry your passport with you. It's required by law for foreigners to have their passports on them at all times. A tiny document, yet a mighty tool, your passport can be the difference between a smooth journey and a bumpy ride. In many countries around the globe, tipping is a common practice, a way to show your appreciation for good service. But when you step foot in Japan, it's a different story. Here, tipping is not a common practice. In fact, tipping can be considered rude and can create awkward situations. It's a stark contrast to what many of us are used to, but when in Japan, it's best to follow the no tipping rule to respect the local customs. So the next time you're dining out or taking a cab, remember no tipping is the way to go in Japan. It might feel strange at first, but it's all part of immersing yourself in the fascinating Japanese culture. So whether you're withdrawing cash, snapping photos, or indulging in a midnight snack, remember, respect the unspoken rules and embrace the culture. By following these, you'll not only navigate Japan with ease, but also show respect for its rich culture and traditions. Enjoy your journey.